Hi guys, welcome back to the Chef Joseph How Cooking. I hope you have a great day. Today we are going to do chicken with red cabbage and southern classic potato Czech dumplings. It's gonna be absolutely amazing. It's very simple, very quick, and everybody can do it. It is not hard whatsoever. So let's do it. We have a beautiful chicken here. What we're gonna do, we're gonna cut it to the quarters. Easy, you can use the cleaver or you can use a knife, doesn't matter, it's very easy to cut the chicken. So, under the leg, see, there you go, another one, perfect. Now, I'm gonna put it into the pan. All right, and we're gonna put it in the oven for probably 15-20 minutes, just for 385 conventional one. And after that, we're gonna add some water and let it cook probably 45 minutes. And chicken gonna be beautiful gold color and ready to go. Okay, so let's do it. So meantime, chicken is in the oven and cooking, and we're going to prepare our red cabbage. So let's do it. I'm gonna cut all this, all this off. All this middle take it out. It's not good. Now, we probably have the part from half of cabbage. Now we're gonna put some salt. Caraway seed, and caraway is much better. And we're gonna put some sugar, probably four or five tablespoons. And <coughs> I'm gonna add it one apple in it. I'm gonna peel the apple. Okay. So now we're gonna add some water in it, just a little bit on the bottom, and we're gonna cook the cabbage probably about 15 minutes. We're gonna like you do some kind of like al dente. You don't wanna overcook your cabbage, otherwise it's gonna be like a mush nasty. Put it in. A little bit of water just on the bottom. Should be enough. Maybe a cup for the cabbage. I'm gonna give you this own juice. All right, I put a bit of cover on it and let it go for 15 minutes. This is beautiful. What I'm gonna do now, put a little bit of water over each piece. Not too much, like I'll make a tablespoon. It's a beautiful juice. And we're gonna let it cook for another hour, 45 minutes. And every like 15 minutes, we're gonna take a spoon and 
or over the chicken kind of a beautiful old color. Let's go to the uh, root onions then we're gonna thicken in our cabbage. So I have a some nice onion here. Probably like half of the onion. Put in the olive oil. Alright. I'm gonna add some garlic season it. Enough. And I'm gonna saute the onions probably I mean three to five minutes or more. And we're gonna add some white all purpose flour, about two tablespoons. Saute probably two minutes. You don't need really too long, about two minutes, and we're gonna add it to our cabbage. Look at this, look beautiful, smells fantastic. I tell you, anytime you cook something and it smells good, you're gonna have a great dish. Anytime you cook something that smells bad, forget it, it's right there, it's bad already. So, all right, looks beautiful. Let's go and take it off, and we're gonna thicken our cabbage. Check the cabbage, looks beautiful. Look at this color, absolutely amazing. What you do, you take a little piece. Perfect. Which I like all done there. What we're gonna do, we're gonna put everything in it. Look at this. I'm going to add a little bit more sugar. Probably two more tablespoons. And white white vinegar. You don't want to do anything else. If you're going to use your white white vinegar for the cabbage. Probably four, five, six tablespoons. Mix it in. That's that's what you want, that's absolutely amazing. I can turn the heat off now. You're gonna taste it. You're gonna, you really want to have a nice, strong, sweet and sour taste. Okay, so. Wow, absolutely awesome. So, now our cabbage is ready. I'm gonna cover it up, let it sit. 10 minutes, you're gonna, all this flavor is gonna come through. So let's look at our chicken, how far we are with it. Ah, look at that, look at that. It looks absolutely beautiful, you see beautiful gold color now. For the king, look at it. It's really amazing. It is. It's the meal. If you like what you're watching, don't forget to subscribe and like my channel. See you next time.